Hello everybody and welcome back to Minecraft. My name is of course Constantine and in this one we are going to be doing a little bit of a recording, a uh, off-stream episode here. And the reason I want to do this one is because we have quite a lot of stuff to uh, keep on doing here. Uh, we have quite a lot of mining to do. Uh, stuff that maybe you guys are not really interested in seeing a live stream because maybe that may be a little bit boring. So uh, just because next stream I want to try something maybe a little bit different, maybe try to go exploring a little bit. Uh, I do want to go and do some other stuff today. Um, maybe try to finish up the house, try to start mining, getting myself some more materials, wood and uh, maybe iron and stuff like that because we're kind of running low on iron and uh, everything else. And also, we are going to need to maybe keep on growing our farm there a little bit. I will start up the farm on top of the house as well on today's uh, episode. And uh, we are going to finish it on the stream though. So, that being said guys, thank you all very much for watching. I hope you guys are going to have a wonderful time. And uh, let's just uh, go ahead and do this one. Alright, let's do this. So, we are done with that side. Now, what I've done here off camera a little bit, I tried to move the chest away from the stairs so that it's easier for me to get up and down here. Uh, I still have to finish up the... Um I still have to finish up the aquarium here eventually. Uh, and I'm also going to want to make it look a little bit better because at the moment I don't like how everything is looking on that side. Maybe I want to put some... Um, yeah, we definitely have to bring some fishies. But not only fishies, I also want to get some uh, uh, green stuff over here from maybe down below this side. I would love to have some of this stuff inside the water there. This would actually look really lovely. Uh, hold up, let me just put this one back inside. Uh, come on, open up. There we go. Let me place this thing over here. We are going to have to figure out something about that. For now, I'm trying to figure out how I want to organize everything. And uh, what I want, what type of room I want to have here above the um, aquarium. So, first of all, let's see. Uh, we still have to go ahead and grab ourselves a lot of wood. Because we're kind of running low on wood. And uh, we are going to need that if I want to finish up everything that I'm planning to finish here. So, first of all... Let me see if we can actually grab... Look at this, we got fishies. I'm definitely going to try to catch myself some fishies, of course, eventually. Oh my god, this is actually pretty deep. Okay. Hmm. So if I do put this stuff in the water in my aquarium... Am I actually going to be able to plant the stuff and uh, make sure it's going to grow exactly how it's looking here? Because that's going to look really awesome if I can. Let's can grab as many of these as I can. Is there any more? Yes, I think there is a little bit more around here. Come on, buddy. Come to Papa. What was that sound? I think I heard some sounds in the water here. It was a little bit weird. Hopefully no uh, zombies or anything. Alright, this should be enough. Uh, let me just try to go ahead and plant it. And uh, see if I can actually grow it underwater. In my, uh, in my aquarium. If I can do that, that would be lovely. I would love it if that was going to work. Alright, now. If I make my way inside the aquarium. Can I actually plant these at the bottom? Oh, we can't look at that. I wonder if these are going to grow. Oh, no, never mind. We can easily just grow him like that. Hmm. That is not bad at all. Look at that. That's going to be looking really awesome once it's going to be done. Of course, we are going to have to work on getting some more water here, though. We cannot plan that, unfortunately. Uh, what's happening? Can I... Oh, God. I got stuck in there for a second. Uh, let me plant some more of these over here. I mean, I'm going to try to plant them all. Why not? Just to get rid of them. This is going to look lovely once we're going to have fishies. And of course, I'm going to need buckets as well. But uh, because I don't really have any more iron right now, I'm not going to be able to do that. Right. Let me plant another one over here, maybe. Another one in the middle here. Another one on this side. Cannot place more, unfortunately, because we need to put some more water in here. There we go. And one last one. Alright, perfect. We are done. Look at that. And I just want to go inside and see how this looks. 
I mean, from up here, it looks absolutely amazing. That's exactly what I wanted. And if I go inside, oh god. Oh, I gotta pay attention, dude. <laughs> Look at this. Even better. Even better. Look at that. But of course, I do want to make uh, the water to go all the way at the top, eventually. Uh, do I have any more food here? No food in here. No food in here. We do have an apple we could eat, of course. Yeah, you know what? Let's just eat this up. Why not? There we go. No food in here, no food in here. Alright, well, in that case, I think I'm gonna have to um, make my way back to the farm. Start uh, getting the farm ready here. Growing up some uh, more animals, I guess. And also, start eating some things, because we definitely need some foods. We desperately need some food right now. Alright, guys. Keep on multiplying, please. I need as much food as I can get. And also, we gotta multiply these fellas, so that we can start getting ourselves a lot of... Uh... Come on, guys. A lot of... Um... A lot of their fur. Come on. Keep on multiplying, guys. Look at that. <laughs> and I think I'm gonna have to go inside there with the shear as well to start getting their fur. Alright, I think this is done. This is done. This is done. Alright, close that down. We are gonna have to expand the sheep area a little bit there because they don't really have enough space to uh, uh, keep on eating, unfortunately. So we definitely have to expand this a little bit. But for now... Let me just get rid of this, this, and this. Let me grab the shears. And let me start cleaning them up a little bit. Alright, at the same time, guys, I know, I know, I don't want to do this, but... I have to. I have to get myself some meat here. I don't want to eat this... I don't want to kill the small ones, though. So, uh, small ones should... Try to avoid me right now. Come on, guys. I don't, want the I don't want to kill the sheep either. Stop it. There's so many of these little ones around. No, 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 no. Come here. Alright, I think we should have enough for now. Uh, let me try to go inside here. And start shitting the sheep. There we go. Alright. Now we're getting everything that we needed. Uh, can I actually get out of here? just so many of them around. Come on, guys. Keep on giving me stuff. I definitely have to find myself some uh, different colored sheep as well. Just because I want to get different colored uh, materials from them. But at the moment, I think we got everything that we needed. Oh, no. Never mind. There's another one. There we go. And I think we should be good. Yeah, we're good. We're good. All right. Let's get out of here. Let me go. There we go. We're definitely going to have to expand this for sure, because uh, at the moment there's way too many of them. Let me remove this one as well. And we should be fine. Perfect. Alright, let me put back the shearing here. And the rest of it I'm just going to take with me. Again, for now, I just want to find out how to grab those different type of... Uh, materials from underwater but let me just reset the day and next day we are gonna start working on grabbing wood uh we definitely need to get ourselves quite a lot of wood because we are completely out of it all right and i think that's about it maybe we have so much stuff to explore around here what is that whoa look at those flowers growing on that tree that is crazy looking what is that even are those a different type of bush or I don't even know, but I think I want to find out. Let me make my way over there a little bit. Let's just try to explore a little bit. Why not? Hey, buddy. Please do not steam me. <laughs> I don't want to hit you or anything. I just want to make sure you're not going to sting me. Hmm. Hopefully this is not going to be a witch's house or anything, right? Oh, it's not. It's just flowers. Huh. Can I grab it all? Interesting. Maybe we can plant some of this stuff back at home. I don't even know what these things are giving me if I uh, plant them back at home, but uh, I most definitely want to grab them. All right. Well, uh, hopefully we are going to be able to plant some of that stuff back at home. Uh, try to beautify our place a little bit. Ooh. 
I think I just heard a cow. I definitely just want to kill this one. <laughs> just because I need its meat. We do have a farm back home, so we don't have to be worried about anything. Oh, God. We gotta pay attention here. Come here, buddy. Stop running. Stop running. There we go. Oh, man, there's just so many caves around my house, though. I gotta pay attention. All right, there we go. Now, I almost got killed by a freaking creeper there. <laughs> but uh, thankfully, we avoided it. That scared me so bad. All right, so we got quite a bit of wood on us right now. We have quite a bit of stacks of wood. And I feel like they are going to be enough. Now, the wood that I just got is not going to be the dark wood, though, uh, which we used to uh, create our house here. Uh, it is going to be a different type of wood, but for now, it should do. And I think I want to start mining here again do i have some lights yes we do yeah i think we should start mining here why not let's just see if we can find ourselves some more diamonds or even metals i'm not gonna say no to metals either uh, also in one of the episodes i'm gonna start focusing on getting this um this this spawner right here done try to uh, make it transform it i guess into a uh, farm why not get ourselves a lot of loot out of that but for now, I do need to go all the over here. So this is where I had the diamonds. And I feel like I want to start mining this way. Now, I'm not planning to keep on going. As you guys know, I'm not planning to keep on going on um, on any caves at the moment. Just because I'm, I don't feel ready. Um, but I am going to do that eventually. Oh, look at that. And we just got iron. Perfect. Finally getting iron. That is what I wanted. Ooh, we're actually kind of getting a lot of it. Look at that. That is perfect. Oh, hold up, hold up. This is not good, this is not good. We gotta trap that up. Uh, I don't want any creepers falling on my head, of course. That's why I had to do that. Hold up, let me block this up over here. And look at that. Apparently... Yeah, that's water over there. Interesting. Yo, let me just grab the iron because we are going to need this. Let me also put a light. Can I put a light over here somewhere? Dang it, that's not going to work. Alright, let me try to block this off then, just like that. Alright, put a light over here. And this should do. I see quite a bit of redstone as well on that side. Uh, so this one is going to be a cave right here. Hmm. Which might not be a bad idea to check, though. Come on, boys. <laughs> they cannot come to me. Seriously, I want to take him out. Alright, then. If you guys, if you guys don't want to come over... I guess I'm going to have to come to you. So there's one. Come here, buddy. Come here. There we go. Oh my god, I'm afraid, though. I mean, look at how dark it is up there. Creepers could easily just follow my head. Yeah, this is um, not the place to explore, unfortunately. I do see some uh, metals that I really, really want to grab, though. Man, this is risky. Now, I don't see no diamonds. Yep, yeah, we gotta pay attention, guys. We all know that creepers like to fall on your heads. From the top there. Please, no creepers fall on my head and kill me. That's gonna be really messed up if it happens. You know what, let me just make sure I block this off so that nobody falls on my head. Alright, hopefully we're fine. Hopefully we're fine. 
Oh, we finally found lava. <laughs> We've been looking for lava for quite a bit. Now, I don't see no... Ooh, I see an archer, though. Look at that guy. He's already coming for me. Interesting. Now, what I don't see, though, I don't see no diamonds anywhere. Hmm. It's really risky to play uh, inside these locations uh, when you're playing hardcore, just because it's so easy to die if a zombie, if a creeper just falls on your head from the top, uh, which, we de which they definitely love to do. So let me just close this down. And uh, that's going to be it for now. I don't want to go inside there and risk it. All right, there we go. We are back now. We have already started smelting some of the iron that we found, uh, which is definitely going to allow us to next up start making myself more pickaxes. Uh, we most definitely have to do a little bit of this. Let's see. We got three, and let me get more. Definitely need a lot of this stuff. Uh, because we are going to be starting to work on maybe creating myself also uh, one mine on this side. Just to start uh, getting myself some more loot. Also, I want to expand this area. I want to have a room especially created only for chests where I'm going to store everything. So um, I'm not going to have you guys watching this. I'm just going to start getting to work here and start trying to remove all these walls. And uh, see how far I can get. Try to expand the home a little bit more. Why not? Alright, there we go. I think uh, this is going to be as far as I am going to go uh, on that side. I am going to section off some rooms here just to make it easier for me to understand how everything is going to look. But um, yeah, this is uh, definitely as far as we go because we actually reached the uh, end of the mountain here where we started building our house. And I definitely don't want to keep on going anymore. I think uh, this is going to be enough house for us. Uh, we're definitely going to have enough space here to start creating a room for uh, all our boxes and everything. I'm also going to start creating a kitchen side on that side, something like that. And uh, somewhere around here, maybe I'm going to start going down, start uh, digging deep, and uh, start getting myself some uh, more materials. Why not? So I am going to start cleaning this up, guys. Uh, maybe I'm going to make a uh, time lapse doing this one. And uh, once I'm done with it, I'm going to come back to you guys. So uh, let's just get back to work. Alright, so this one over here, I'm guessing this side, I think I want to make the chests uh, right over here. Uh, but of course, I am going to use some wood to do that, just to make it look a little bit more pretty. Uh, let's see, do we have any more wood? Yes, we do. And of course, I am using the dark wood just because, I don't know, I feel like we started off uh, creating this house using the dark wood. And I feel like I want to finish it up using the dark wood. So, uh, first of all, I want to make a wall of dark wood on this side. That's how I want to do it. And then I'm going to start sticking the uh, chest inside. So let me just clean this up a little bit here. Alright, we do have a little bit of gravel falling down, but hopefully uh, no issues up there. We are at least getting flint out of this gravel, and if I'm not mistaken, we are going to need the gravel eventually. Uh, let me grab the cobblestone, block this off over here. We don't want no uh, creature to spawn in there. And... Next up, we are going to have to uh, start making the dark wood wall, just like that. Alright, next up, this is where I'm going to start placing the chest inside. Uh, hold up, let me just light this place up so that it's not going to be too dark. Let's see, let me remove this, get my... Do I have an axe? Yes, I do have an axe actually on me. So that's going to be one, that's going to be two. And let's see. I mean, I think I want to have on the... Hold up, how many chests can I put in here? Two in here. Two in here. Two in here, slot, and then... Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think I could expand it that way. So, um, let me start up like that. <laughs> oh my god, we got so much stuff in here. <laughs> We're definitely going to have to start moving things around, of course. 
And now we're gonna be able to uh, finally be organized. Let's put that over there. There we go. Um, I think I could start making one more row. Why not? You know what? Yeah, let's just start making one more row. It's just... Why the heck not? I think we have spot for one more row chest. All right, perfect. That is how I want it to be. Well, we definitely have sticks and leather. Uh, not sure if I have enough though for all of these chests, but I at least want to start it up. So let me grab the leather from here. Let me grab the sticks and let's see if I can actually make myself uh, some of these uh, frames. Oh, we can make 11. All right, that's not bad. Let's see if it's going to be enough, though. All right, there we go, guys. Now, we have finally finished uh, organizing this place a little bit. Of course, I'm going to keep on organizing them even more. Now, I do want to have this room, as I enter through here, I do want to have this whole room filled up with chests, just as uh, I did right now. Uh, I'm also thinking of having this side as well, maybe right over here. And uh, this means I'm going to have to make a double-sided wall over here of uh, wood. Uh, but I'm, yeah, I think, I think I'm going to focus on doing that. Why not? And I'm going to have the signs for the chest over here, over on this wall. Um, or maybe I should actually... Oh, yeah, you know what? I think I should actually move on this wall this side instead. And uh, work on from over here. Yeah, I definitely want to do that. So let me just go ahead and try to see if I have any more wood. Uh, we do have some oak logs. The problem is, yeah, these are not dark woods. <laughs> these are definitely not dark woods, which are definitely going to be a little bit of an issue. Uh, if I want to keep this looking the same way, of course. So I may need to start going and grab myself some more wood from the other forest over there. But look at how good this uh, aquarium looks right now with the vegetation inside. And once I'm going to finish adding the water in, that's going to be even more perfect, of course. Alright guys, so as I was getting back home here, uh, I wanted to make a window on this side of the house and look at what I just found. This are two, these are two llamas. I'm not quite sure how these got here though. I think there is a rope tied up to one of them. They don't want to go down. I think down below there, there might be a salesman or something. I don't know how this happened, but uh, hold up. I want to, I want to see if I can actually get these llamas for myself. Not sure again, I was, I was saying, not sure what happened here. I just saw these llamas. But I'm hoping that I can get them for myself. Hold up, let me try to get some wheat. Oh man, if this is gonna work. Oh, we only have two wheat, seriously? Well, at least I want to get them inside my house. And then I'm gonna try to uh, see what else I can do. Hold up, let me just get the glass over here. Because we are gonna have to close this down. Let's see if I can actually get the llamas to come in. Oh, look at that! They are in my house! <laughs> I am not sure what is happening right now. Uh, I do see a rope over here. But, uh, nobody's pulling them. So maybe something glitched in here? I think there might be a, um, salesman, yeah, but he's invisible. Why is he invisible, though? Hey, buddy. Yeah, this guy is definitely invisible. I can hear him. Hmm. Can I give the llamas the wheat? I mean, I, I did feed her, but... Can I interact with this guy, though? So I'm not quite sure exactly... Oh! Oh, there we go. We can now interact with him. So this guy is definitely invisible. I'm not sure why, though. I am not sure why this guy is invisible. I would love it if I could actually grab this stuff from him. Hmm. Interesting. I mean, I don't have any emeralds. I cannot really give him anything. Gray dye, aluminum, or alum. Oh, he's becoming invisible again. Look at that. Ah, he's just drinking potions to become invisible. That's how he's doing this. I get it now. Interesting. What is it gonna happen if I actually kill this guy? Can I actually grab his llamas? Dude, you better not leave my house. <laughs> I want you to uh, stay in my house here. You know what? Hold up. Let me check and see what's gonna happen if I kill this guy. Uh, although, I 
I don't really want to grab anything from him right now, but I really want his llamas. Because I have no um, emeralds to give him in uh, so that he can give me stuff. Yeah, look at that. That's not going to work. But if I kill him, can I actually grab his llamas? Let me just try and see. <laughs> Stop spitting at each other. Oh my god. But at least they are mad at each other right now. Hmm. How do you make rope though? Hold up, I think I need some rope to uh, try to steal them from this guy. I accidentally hit one of them and now they uh, they hate each other for some reason. But the thing is, I may be able to... Oh, hold up. I may be able to lock one of these llamas inside maybe right Rumi here. And hopefully she's not going to be able to get out. Yeah, hopefully that's going to work. Because eventually the illager is actually going to live. Or not the illager... Uh, the Wandering Traveler, I guess that's how this guy's called. Um, do you have any more fences in here? I mean, I guess I could make some more if I need to. But for now, at least we locked this one in. We know for sure that this one is... Actually, hold up. No, never mind. Hmm, the Illager is here with him. What? What did this guy got here? Well, in that case, I may need to go and lock down the one at the... <sighs> Dang it! They both escaped. Never mind. I really wanted to separate them there, but that did not work. I'm just hoping that they're not going to kill each other, though. Well, at least if one of them is going to die, one of them is going to be alive. So, uh, whatever happens here, happens. <laughs> no, 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 you're not going anywhere. Don't leave. Hmm. How can I get these guys separated, though? No, 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 no. Dang it. This Illager keeps on dragging them away, and I do not want to kill him or anything, because then the Llamas are going to start attacking me, I'm pretty sure about it. And the problem is, I have no idea how to... Oh, look at this, one of them died, I knew it! Oh, well, at least we got the lead, so that we can probably uh, grab this Llama. Well, one Llama has died. Um, hmm. Next up, we gotta just... Get rid of this fella, though. The problem is I don't want to attack him because if I do start attacking him, the llama is most definitely going to escape. What if I just leave him there and I actually get him stuck, not the llama? Ah, he's going to try to run away. He knows. Look at this. He actually blew up everything I had here. Seriously, buddy. I don't know. Don't take my diamond away. How can I do this without the llama attacking me? The thing is, I don't have any bows or anything. There we go. Alright, we locked him in. We locked him in, so he's not going to be able to leave anymore from that place. He's definitely going to be stuck in there. Uh, now, the question is... What if... What if I close the llama in here? Hold up, buddy. Hold up. I gotcha. Just want to close the llama here so that she doesn't see what I do. Then I'm going to be able to uh, take out this bad boy. <laughs> Stop looking at me, llama. You gotta stay in there all alone. You gotta close you in. There's no easy to do this, buddy. Sorry. There we go. And now. All right, there we go. We got the illager. Hopefully the llama did not see that, and hopefully she is not gonna attack me. Nope, she is not. Alright, well, what if I grab her now? No, 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 please don't speed at me. Huh. Well, we got ourselves the llama. Interesting. Interesting indeed. We finally got her. Um, hold up, before I do anything, let me just get rid of the dark oak. That we just got from the forest. And, uh, hold up. Let me place this back up here like that. I don't even know what I had here. <laughs> I don't even know what I had here. Alright. And I do want to grab the llama and I want to tame her. But in, in order to tame her, of course, I am going to have to get myself uh, some wheat. So, come on over, llama. What are you doing? 
it is a little bit unfortunate that we haven't managed to grab both of them, but I was a little bit afraid that the llamas would start attacking me if I uh, wanted to kill the illager. But... Let me grab this, and... Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, never mind. I think I got her 10. Yeah, I think I actually gave her 10. Uh, which means if I actually go ahead and grab the saddle. Could I maybe put the saddle on it? No. Um, wait, where's the rope? I don't see the rope anymore. Oh, there we go. We got the lead. I mean, I gave her the food. I'm not sure if I can actually grab her to have her as my pet now. Hmm. Well, I didn't even know, but uh, I am going to keep her at home. Hopefully, she's not going to despawn. And uh, we should try to figure out what we got to do with her, I guess. Oh, no, 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 no. Get out of there. <laughs> Get out of there, buddy. These guys are kind of clumsy, eh? And uh, next up, we are going to need a fence because I will have to fence her out. Uh, try to make sure she's not going to leave anywhere. Um, so what if I place a fence right up here like that? And now I just use the lead. Oh, there we go. We can tie her in. Interesting. So is she actually going to be in mine now? Hopefully she's not going to disappear, because uh, if she's not going to disappear, this has definitely been worth it. And look at that, guys. I think uh, this is where I'm going to have to actually end up the episode right here for now. I was definitely not expecting to get myself a llama in this one. Um, that was totally unexpected. I was just uh, coming back home, trying to build up another window, and then suddenly I saw a llama on the window there. <laughs> that was the most random thing ever, but apparently a lot of random things have happened in this uh, Minecraft series, and uh, hopefully this is going to keep on going because I'm going to have a lot of fun with this one. Anyway, guys, that being said, thank you all very much for watching. Uh, let me know down in the comments what I'm supposed to do with this kind of llama, and uh, hopefully it's not going to despawn on us. I mean, I give her everything I have. I give her food. I get her. I uh, tied her to the fence here. It should definitely not not despawn anymore. But anyway, that being said, thank you all very much for watching. Stay safe out there, and I will see you guys in the next live coming up really soon. Bye, everybody! Yeah.